Dr. Joseph Favaza came to St. A's from Stonehill College in Massachusetts, where he served as provost and vice president of academic affairs. As his wife was retiring, he too became restless, and the two planned to head south to warm temperatures. And then the possibility of St. Anselm College arose, and I have to admit, at first, I did not give it serious thought. Our plan was set, after all, until Patty said, what do you got to lose? <laughs> so we made a left turn, and here we are, ready to face the snow and cold in a new place. Go figure. While Dr. Favaza was officially inaugurated today, he began his tenure as president in July and has had a chance to dip his feet in the water already looking to the future. We want to begin to offer a few targeted graduate programs. That's going to be fun to, to, to get that going. Uh, there's some new programs that we're looking at at the undergraduate level. Dr. Favaza also is faced with challenges. We're a Catholic college in New England, and, and that means that we've got great opportunity, but, but there are some challenges we have to look at. I mean, higher education is changing quite a bit right now, and, but we have so many strengths here at St. Anselm. We've got great alums, we have got great students, great faculty, and it's just a matter of making sure that we can take all those strengths and go in the same direction. And for the new president, something else to cross off his bucket list. I knew one day my name would be on a scoreboard. <laughs> In Manchester, Suzanne Rontree, WMUR News 9.